The local woman and child inside of a home as bullets were sprayed. In this new video, you can see nearly a dozen bullet holes left behind. The shooting happened just a couple of blocks from John Love Elementary School, and that school was placed on a code red just before dismissal today. I'm Tanika Hughes. I'm John Bachman. Action News Jack's Brittany Verner is live outside of that house on the east side. Brittany, neighbors say that they heard continuous gunfire. And neighbors say after they heard those gunshots, they saw a man run away. I'm standing right up on the house, and you can see some of these bullet holes, some of them that's even pierced the glass. I counted more than a dozen. Lee Campbell says the sound of gunfire pierced through his home when someone opened fire on a house on his block. I heard gunshots going off. The first one was one single. Then it paused, then I heard just a continuous shot. After that, he says he heard a second pause before more shots were fired again. He was posted up firing at the house. Neighbors told Action News Jax they didn't see any cars outside, but they did see a man wearing a white shirt standing next to the tree in front of that house. Campbell says when the shooting happened, a woman and her baby were inside. Thankfully, they were not struck by bullets, but it sent the neighborhood into a panic. And John Love Elementary, which is about a block away, was briefly put on lockdown. I'm like in shock. Now neighbors are hoping this doesn't happen again. This is a quiet neighborhood. Uh, we really don't have anything going on. I think the last time we had anything going was like over two years ago. Police have not said if they have any leads on a suspect, but right now we know that they are still investigating. Reporting live in Jacksonville, Brittany Verner, CBS 47, Action News Jax.